October is National Cybersecurity Awareness Month, and here at Illinois, we're preparing the next generation of cybersecurity experts who will soon enter this critical and emerging field. My name is Aishani Dutta. I'm a junior, and I'm studying computer science. Every kind of aspect of technology has the potential to be exploited in some way from like the hardware to the way we design like the user interface. Um, so I am just really intrigued by all the problems that like technology presents when it comes to cybersecurity and I love to get my hands dirty in solving them and I think the impact as well of being able to protect um, you know, civilians and the uh, general populace from like attacks, hacking um, is something that also really appeals to me. I think right now, like my interests are everywhere. I really feel like every day I learn something new or something interesting that's relevant to the field of cybersecurity. And I think like, I want to do that. I want to work on that. Um, and so there's lots of like amazing research being done, for example, at a lot of national labs and like um, places like NIST that are setting the standard for what like the most secure technology and the most secure protocols we could have uh, look like. And then on the other hand, there's a lot of work being done at like smaller agencies that are focused on improving and like responding to the incidents that we're dealing with on the like here and now. And so I am currently interested in everything, like everything in between. So um, I, I just think that there's like so many cool problems to work on and I would be so grateful to get the opportunity to tackle any one of them. Something that really caught my eye, especially during the COVID crisis, was um, at the beginning of like March in 2020, a lot of people lost their jobs and were going to um, like un sign up for unemployment benefits on a lot of these online sites. And there was this really big issue with um, kind of a lack of cybersecurity personnel working on this technology. And as a result, a lot of the sites to sign up for things like food stamps and unemployment benefits and like Medicare and health insurance, a lot of these like websites were not as robust as they could have been and they were prone to a lot of vulnerabilities and cybersecurity attacks and so people who were at their most vulnerable point in life seeking assistance from the government and putting in very valuable personal information into these sites um, were like suffering from things like identity theft because the architecture and infrastructure um, to build things like websites for unemployment benefits and food stamps was not as robust as it could it could be and so like i would love to be somebody who could work on making these very like critical resources and very critical pieces and aspects of technology um, stronger and safer for people who need to access these government resources